So well done. That was a really good go. Thanks. Um, next time, can you please make that? Yes. This is what I asked you to make and yes. you made a bowl. You don't get a job here at the pottery studio. That's all right. I've got to go home tonight anyway. Okay. Wait, do we have yours? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Illy. Illy. No. Oh. Make sure you subscribe, <laughs> subscribe and shit. <laughs> I thought you were meaning like do a sign with your hands. <laughs> That's not what I mean. <laughs> Hi, welcome to today's video. My name is Lily and we have a special guest today, Stacey! <laughs> She's come all the way from New Zealand just to learn how to throw a pot with me. There's been no other reason for your holiday. No. Stacey's my sister from New Zealand. Can you tell her? Because we look quite alike. We look exactly the same. Just tricking. <laughs> we have different parents. We don't actually like each other very much. We hate each other. That's, that's a joke. Um, today what we're going to do is I'm going to show Stacey how to throw a pot and then we're going to do a throw along together afterwards. But to start with, I'm going to bombard you with loads of information. Okay. It's <laughs> 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 so <laughs> There's a bottom. It's got a bottom. Oh, I already am going to have an issue with this. Why? Sensory issue? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yep, Stacey's gonna have a sensory issue. Okay, you made that look real easy. I reckon it's gonna be real hard. What if it's really easy? What if you're really good at it and I get really intimidated? <sighs> and unlikely. Um, I'm okay, so cone. It's, that's exactly what it's called. It's, exactly it's called coning. Stacey's good at this. Mm -hmm. This is the naughty bit. Get it really wet. <laughs> this is a family friendly channel. This is called centering. Okay. Can you see it's centered yeah. in the middle of the wheel? And you can tell if it's not centered because it is Oh, wide. yeah, right, yeah, yeah. Kind of love heart with your hands, maybe. Yeah, kind of. So this is like, I'm putting all the pressure in there and like kind of on top as well. And I'm like squeezing in. Okay. Basically, you just have to think like, in. Okay. Yeah. So now I will press down. This is called opening. Like widen it. So I'm gonna like crook my fingers and pull it towards mm -hmm. me. But I'm not gonna press down or like go up at all. I'm just gonna pull it towards me. Okay. Like parallel to the wheel head. And look at my arms are like anchored on here. Okay. So you anchor there as well. <laughs> okay, and now we flatten this out. This is called compressing the base. Mm -hmm. And it's important, otherwise you get an S crack, which okay. is, this stands for Stacey. Yeah. yeah. This is this been, seriously so impressive. <laughs> Thank you. This has been the supporting hand, and now we move over, and then this is the like inside hand, and we do like a little dog thing, okay. a little pincer, and we're going to pinch the clay up. And we're gonna like aim towards this imaginary point up here, okay. which is like the star on the Christmas tree, mm -hmm. to like bring the clay walls up. Okay. So you start right at the bottom, and you squeeze the clay. And my inside fingers aren't doing that much. My outside uh, fingers are doing all the work. Yeah. And I like ease the pressure off the back here. Mm -hmm. And I continue all the way until there's no clay. Okay. 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 And then compress the rim. And I'm going to repeat that again. Okay. So I just need to re-wet the clay and I'll repeat that. But I'm going to be a little bit softer with the pressure. Mm -hmm. Easing right off, but I'm still bringing the clay up. Does it get quite wobbly the like thinner it gets? Exactly. Oh, yeah. That is a wobble, mm. but I will get rid of that in a bit. Pull a little bit more clay up. So I'll just do that like a lot softer this time. And then I'm gonna use this tool, which is a wooden rib, mm -hmm. which is like if you need a rib replacement, you get one made out of wood. Oh, All right. Most of it is made out of this. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> and then we press, mm. and this is like an extension of our fingers, and we go, I'm gonna do that, and then I'm gonna move the whole thing up. Okay. So as if like I was doing that still, mm -hmm. but they're moving together. Mm -hmm. And where's the contact? At, at all points? Mm, kind of. It's kind of like I'm pushing in at the bottom. Oh, yeah. And I'm bringing it up. Oh, that is, I'm going to struggle. 
Yeah, I mean, it's not even. Okay. okay. And then squeeze out your little sponge. Take mm -hmm. out the water from the inside and the outside. And just rim one more time. Get in there with your wooden knife tool. Carve underneath. Mm -hmm. We're going to take it off the wheel. I can't believe how fast you made that. I mean, it is actually my job. It's true. Remove that and slide it off. Okay. Okay. Easy. So, Stacey, if you're really good at this, I'm going to have a bit of an identity crisis because I'm the creative sister. Oh, yeah, I'm not the creative sister. So what sister are you? The youngest, loudest, annoying. But, yeah, but. Oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> Stacey is the. Strongest. Yeah, definitely the strongest. Yeah, okay. She could lift anyone up. Definitely me. Yeah, I could lift you, but I couldn't lift anybody. Do you think you could bench me? Yes. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Under 70 kilo. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. That's impressive. So we're going to slam it down. Do I have to right. put any water on that? No water. You were right with what you were doing. So slam it down. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's good. And you get it nice and in the middle. So Where? Like, not yet. You just want to like secure the... Yeah, that's good. That's good. So, so now wet your hands. Oh, the water's warm. That's nice. Yeah, I did it for you. Thank you. Now, so anchor your elbows, oh, yeah. and you're going to use the strong part of your hand mm -hmm. and like your fingers to um, kind of push against each other and think in the middle. Okay. And you're definitely strong enough to do this, so don't piss around. <laughs> and you want to like dip your hands in a bit more water every now and again because if it starts getting a bit too dry, too dry, then it's not good. It's not good. See how you've got like a bit of a. Oh Thank yeah. You so you want to go right down to the wheel head with your hands. Yep. And mm -hmm. you're going to squeeze the clay and bring it up. And it's like a quite a slow motion, so I'm just squeezing it and then oh, up, 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 up. Uh, yep, toning it. <laughs> and then just slow your hands. Just do it a bit more slow. That's it. That's fine. And if it's not centered on your cone up, that's fine because you kind of do the centering on the way down. Okay. Yeah. That's good. Is that center? Is it? No, you can see it wobbling a bit, but that's fine. Go back down on top, so put a bit more water on. Mm -hmm. Can you make an L shape with your hand? Mm -hmm. Like this that part here is kind of making like a right angle. Mm -hmm. so we're going to put that on top, and then this one sort of presses down on top as well. You make a little cross, and then these fingers mm -hmm. on your right hand mm -hmm. squeeze the clay. Like, literally squeeze the clay. Can you bend your fingers or not? <laughs> <laughs> Have you not done that before? Bend your fingers on your right oh, hand. On your right hand. Like it's this? No, on right your right Like this? Ah, oh, yes, okay. Yeah? Yeah. And now push. So you want to be pushing down and with this part of your hand that way at the same time. So this part, this uh. hand is pushing that way. Pose that pressure with oh. your fingers. Don't let that clay control you, please. <laughs> You're way stronger than that clay. That's pretty good. Is it not bad? It's not bad, although it's still a cone, it's... so you haven't gone down at all, so you've just gone across. Oh, I see. So now push down as well, so you can do this like chop motion with your right hand and chop down on top. So press down and at the same time with this part of your left oh, hand. Oh, I see. Push across. This one pushing across and that one going down. Nice. How far down do you reckon? What's the problem if it's not centered? Maybe I just need to stop for a second. You just don't make a round pop. <laughs> <laughs> it will like maybe like fall a bit. Oh no, that's okay. Okay. So you can't cheat. You can't be doing that. Oh sorry. You have to do that like, while it's moving. So just think like I need to be. My hands are arrows, and I need to push it down and in. At the moment, you're only touching it with a little bit of your hands. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> And when you do that, um, you don't have that much surface area to actually do anything with. Okay. So you want to be kind of hugging the clay and like really lean your body weight over it. That's it. That's much better. Nice. I mean, it's, you can see that it's still wobbling. Yeah. So get in there again and keep keep with that. Why don't we try coning up again and then we'll go back down. Okay. Bring it up. Oh, it's got a hole in the middle. That's okay. Mine's got a little hole as well. 
and then down is so the chopper. maybe chopper on top and then push with this hand towards that corner i've got so much slop it actually is called slop <laughs> 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 Yeah. It's so much harder than what you think it's going to be. It's looking pretty, pretty good. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> Do that. It's, it's a little bit wobbly, but I think we can work with it. Okay. Okay, next step we're going to open. Okay. So maybe slow the wheel down a little bit. And we're going to go a little bit more water on top and on the sides. And with this hand, it's going to be supporting. Put your thumb of your right hand here and we're going to like hinge at that point. Okay. And then this is going to come in, find the middle, your two, your index finger and your middle finger. Mm -hmm. Which is not those two, but that'll oh, work. Yeah, it's that'll not. work. It's fine yeah. if that feels more comfortable. Find the middle and then we're going to just press down. With the index more? Uh, both, it's just like an even amount of pressure. That's okay, you've got the nipple. <laughs> <laughs> You're pushing down rather than across. Oh, yeah. uh, okay. Yeah, so you, push, you can kind of do push. it with your thumbs if you want, if that feels better. Yeah, I think that might. Yeah. Kind of connected with your thumbs, so try and do it with both thumbs okay. like that. Yeah, that's nice. It's okay. That's good. And now slowly remove your hands. Lovely. It's a bit vasy. That's fine. Oh, okay. Yeah. Wow, you look so stiff. <laughs> okay. And now we're going to switch so back to this movement where mm -hmm. um, your the fingers index. are going in. Yeah. And you're going to find the middle, and you're going to crook your fingers and drag them out. I have go really slow. You don't want to. Kind of overshoot the base so go parallel to the wheel here shall i do it first yeah okay i'm going to crook my fingers drag them two centimeters towards me down to like six o'clock oh yeah okay there yeah nice so we take the hands off real good stunning stuff yes she is beautiful she is quite beautiful mm -hmm. yeah squeeze your sponge out and we're going to compress the base. So you're not really going to be moving any of the clay, you're just going to be kind of cleaning up the base a little bit. So you're going to go from the middle um, and press down with your fingers on the sponge mm -hmm. from the middle down to like four o'clock and then back again a couple of times. One, two, three. <laughs> on the base, right? Oh, just on the base. Yeah. Lovely. Okay, now we're going to pull the walls up, which okay. is a quite scary bit actually. Okay. So we're going to, this was the outside head. Mm -hmm. Did you get a saw back? That's why I've actually raised my wheel up. Oh. Hit me up down below in the comments if you want a video about uh, the height of my wheel. Because it's quite interesting. Okay, anyway, we're going to swap. So this hand is now going to be the inside hand. So you're going to be using your um, ring finger and middle finger. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. That little dog shape. And we're going to be working at four o'clock again. And you're going to gently squeeze the clay because you've got a reasonably thin wall there. We're going to gently squeeze the clay up into this current shape so these fingers are doing most of the work these fingers are underneath the thumb mm -hmm. and we're going to be squeezing up good okay that's a, a bit slower maybe yeah a little bit less pressure but keep it going all the way up keep going all the way up and ease the pressure off but keep it going Lovely. Okay, we're turning it into a bowl. That's good. I'm gonna. I'll adjust my strategy. Okay. We always were actually gonna make a bowl. But <laughs> it actually looks. Like, it looks good. It looks great. Has it somehow centered itself. You centered it. That's why. Oh, you did it. I did not really. <laughs> okay. Okay. Next step, we're gonna do that again. But instead of pulling up, we're gonna kind of scoop. Should these I wash my hands? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you, you've got no clay on your hands. What are you on about? I've got a lot of clay. Okay, I'm going to scoop my fingers so these are going to go on the inside. And once we get to the shoulder here, mm. I'm going to bring it up. So this is the movement. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. From four o'clock. Yeah, exactly. So from the very middle. Oh, yeah. Push down and drag it across mm -hmm. and scoop it up. Slow the wheel speed a little bit. Nice. Really good. Okay. On the shoulder and go up and out. Beautiful. Keep it going all the way up. Really nice. This is going to be really good for my serotonin or endorphin. Like the 
One of them. One of them. Both of them. Dopamine? Dopamine. Who knows? Generated something today. Yeah. You generated Oh my well. gosh, yours looks amazing. So does yours. Mine's Please. a small guy. Give a little bit less clay than this. Squeeze the sponge out again. And from the middle, gently, we're just like removing some of that slip. So mm -hmm. like gently drag it up the side of the wall. Really nice. Really good. Cool. Now on the outside, kind of get rid of some of that slip and drag it all the way up to the side of the wheel. Oh, that's cool. Should I go a little bit closer? Yeah, get in there. Get in there, girl. Now this is a bit that's scary, scary edge, but we're going to go underneath and drag some of that clay out of there. Get in there a bit more, babe. Now turn the wheel off. Is that it? Yeah, that you're done. You did it. You made a little bowl. Get some water on your sponge and we're gonna squeeze it like oh. there. <clears throat> That's it. Mm -hmm. And then we're gonna drag this, we're gonna drag the water through underneath it. Mm -hmm. Like that. With the big lane. Yeah, the lane's optional, but press down with your thumbs so that you're like really holding it taut. Drag that water through. That's it. Cut. Okay, now I'll give you a little bat so you can put it onto it. How long does it take to dry? Mm, at least overnight. Okay. I'll trim it for you. Stacey will be on a plane later today. So yeah, I don't get to take it home. home. Maybe I'll send it to you. Okay, anyway, you're gonna drag it. See, the, thick, the base is a bit thicker, so you can get under there with your fingers and just kind of push it off. Mm -hmm. And then you're gonna pick it up and put it on your little bat. Okay. Okay, now pick it off. I think I'm right. You're not, no. You are. Oh. And then exactly. Like that? Yep. <gasps> oh, sorry. Sorry. I did it wrong. I was like, uh oh. No, 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 it was good. Show the camera, please. She did it. Should she we cheers them? Yep. Cheers. Cheers. What is it? Mm, I think it. Ramen? Might be for hummus. <laughs> yeah, hummus. Yeah. It will shrink about 10%. Okay. So a little bit smaller. She's a little, she's It's okay. Quirky. I'll trim her for you. Okay. That actually is probably quite a nice size for a little for olive? snack. Yeah, for olive. Yeah. Um, it's exactly what you were aiming for. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, I wish we could do this all the time. I know, it's cut. I mean, I'd waste so much of your clay because I'm not very good, but. You actually wasted no clay. This is, that was a really good, like, beginner. Okay, so the first and only time that I have done this was in intermediate. Yeah. When that, so people who don't live in New Zealand or maybe Australia, intermediate school is like like eleven and twelve. Yeah, eleven and twelve. Yeah, yeah. Ish. It's like between primary school and high school. There's this like other bit of school. <laughs> didn't do pottery until I was at university. I went to art school because I didn't get to do it at intermediate school. <laughs> And they, it was wasted on me. Yeah, but now you've got a proper job. Then I don't. <laughs> <laughs> like right now, I'm like, oh, the clay under my fingernails. Yeah, I get used to it. My nails always rank. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they are. Yeah. Stacey, for beginners, for you've done this one time. That is a very, very good job. Do you want to give it a score out of 10? Because <laughs> we were aiming for this. Yeah, okay. Execution, effort. And execution effort and um, honestly the fact is that you got a pot out of it rather yeah. than like not because mm. it's really easy to just fuck it up. And, um, I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. Oh, I got splattered. Oh, no. <laughs> yes please. <laughs> it's not much to fault. Although we were aiming for that. Oh. Yeah that, that's a 10 out of 10. Oh is it a 10? Yeah. Just like you. You're a 10. This has become like a bit of a tradition, making pots with my family when they come to visit. Dad and Sue did it, then they came to visit. And they weirdly made the exact same thing. They made like little ramekins. Cute. They were really cute. Shannon made something, I can't remember what she made. Bossy and Henry, um, our niece and nephew, they've made some stuff. So well done, it's a really good go. Thanks. Um, next time, can you please make that? Yes. This is what I asked you to make and yeah. you made a bowl. So you don't get a job here at the pottery studio. That's all right. I've got to go home tonight anyway. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Illy. Illy. Well done. Thanks. Cheers. Cheers. Bye. See you next time. Please like and subscribe. Yeah.
and turn notifications on. Oh yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. And how do, and how can you follow me on May social Ceramics media? on socials? Yeah, M A E dot Ceramics. Where can they follow you? In private. Don't even try. She's married. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> I'll be back next week with another video on something pottery related. So I'll see you next week. Okay, thanks. Bye. I love you. What? What? The jets. Good job. That was fun. That was fun.